So the, it's uh, afternoon and uh, we're still getting some fairly decent amperage. Uh, it doesn't really go down below 10 hardly at all ever. It stays above 10, goes to 25, 30. I've seen it today hit 44 amps or so a couple of times. So it's doing quite well. Uh, I don't know if you can tell in here, there it goes to 32, 34 amps. Voltage is holding at 26, and the inverters are the inverters going pretty well. So, very happy with it. It's working well. The new redesign really uh, gets better use of uh, better use of both of the uh, turbines. So, I'm very happy with this right now. Can't uh, really complain at all. Hope you all enjoy it. And uh, we'll make another video whenever I'll have some new inverters that I just ordered. And uh, I'll have the solar panels come in, a few more meters. And this, uh, this panel will change somewhat. And hopefully it will give us a better amperage output. Thanks and take care. And this is my boy Danilo. He's my helper. Isn't that right? Yeah. yeah. You helped me with the with the work on the turbines, didn't you? Yeah. And the tower. <laughs> and there's those things there. Hauling pretty good. They're definitely working quite well right now. Very good performance. This Winmax uh Turbines are pretty darn, pretty darn good. Uh, they're still a little flexing up there, up top, but not a whole lot. Uh, the guy wires that we put in place took care of most of it. Uh, I just need to move the guy wires in the front a little further out to give it more stability. Right now they're too vertical. So, but thanks for watching. So you can see we're getting we're getting some good winds. Uh, the turbines are actually doing quite well. A few minutes ago they hit 50 amps. Uh, we have about a 20 mile an hour wind. Uh, well, the wind is not 20 miles, but it is gusting up to about 20 to 23. I think is what they said. <clears throat> the wind is uh, supposed to be about 19 or so. Uh, but as you can see, it comes and goes and comes and goes. There's almost 50 amps. That was 48 amps actually that it hit. Uh, let it keep going a little, a little more. I only have about three minutes worth of recording time left on this uh, card, so hopefully you'll see it. But uh, she's cranking along pretty good. Those turbines are really cooking. They're doing quite well. Twenty-five amps, twenty amps, fifteen amps. It just comes and goes. The wind is actually shifting. And that's kind of part of the problem, I guess. So We'll see if we get a good, another good gust of wind, and uh, we'll go from there. You can see that sucker does get up to 50 amps. Don't stay up there, but it gets up there when you get a gust of wind. That's about, you know, 23. Uh, supposed to be gusting up to 23 to 25. So, but she's actually doing quite well. I definitely need to uh, split the uh, amp meter between the two uh, turbines because a, a single 50 amp meter is not enough. Uh, if I get a really good windy day, that meter is going to pay out at 50 amps big time. Uh, especially when I add the uh, 
other turbine and uh, we'll have to show that to you later Let's see what we're going to do with that uh, there's a big 5 kilowatt turbine that I'm working on it's actually a 9 kilowatt but I think I'm going to be able to get about 5 kilowatts out of it and you'll see what that looks like in a little while uh, probably in the next few days I'll shoot a video of how that project is coming along and uh, the ultimate goal here is to be uh, bill free when it comes to uh, power I'm actually probably producing a little more power than uh, I do need as you can see it's charging very well there's one of the charge controllers and the end meter in the background so they're cooking cooking right along There we go to 35 amps, 36 amps, steady at 30, drops a little bit, then you get get another gust, it goes right back up. And these things are cooking, these Winmax uh, 1 kilowatt turbines are just pretty darn awesome. Let me go outside and I'll take a, I'll take a short video of what they look like in action right now. So that's them right there really cooking along as you can see that power uh, I'm definitely gonna need some stronger guy wires for it I got another tie down 